I'm Anil Kumar and here is another application question from the assignment of my student. Let us see how to use quadratic equations to solve real life situations. The question here is, the height of a triangle is 2 more than its base. Area is 17.5 meter square. Find length and base. So we are given a right triangle. The height of a triangle is 2 more than its base. The area is 17 meter square so height of a right triangle the term is missing here let me add height of a right triangle is 2 more than its base area is 17.5 meter square find the length and the base so let me sketch one right triangle here so here we are given the relation between the two sides it says height of the right triangle is 2 more than the base let's say base be B let me take variables as x and y, x and height is 2 more, so it is x plus 2, right. Area is given to us as equals to 17.5 meter square. Find length and, find length of the base. So that is the question. So we can relate height and base with the area. Area of a triangle, you know, is half base times height. So in this case base is x for us and the height is x plus 2. Area is given to us as 17.5. So we can always find x. Let's multiply first by 2 so that we get rid of this fraction. So we have 17.5 times 17.5 times 2 is equals to let's expand this x square plus 2x and we'll bring all the terms to one side so we have x square plus 2x minus 2 times 17.5 which is 35 okay so let's write 35 here now to solve this equation you can either do factoring or you could do quadratic formula right now to do factoring we are looking for two numbers whose product is minus 35. So that could be 7 times 5, whose difference is 2. So we could write this as x plus 7 times x minus 5. You got the idea, right? So you can factor using the techniques learned already. Or you could also use the quadratic formula to solve. So we get 0 equals to x minus 7 times x minus 5. So that gives us possibility of two different answers. So either x plus 7 equals to 0 or x minus 5 equals to 0. If I equate x plus 7 to 0, I get x equals to minus 7. If I equate x minus 5 to 0, I get x equals to 5. Remember, we are talking about dimensions of a triangle. They cannot be negative. So that is not valid x equals to 5 is fine. So the solution here is that the base x is equals to 5 and height is x plus 2 which is 5 plus 2 as 7. So when we write down the answer we should include units. Since the area is in meter square we should say base equals to 5 meters and height equals to 7 meters, right? So that is how it should be solved. I hope that helps. Thank you.